In this video, I would like to show you how to use your SiteTalk account. Go to www.sitetalk.com and press enter. On this page, you will see four sections. The one on the top is for your username and your password to log in into your account. At the bottom is to sign up on SiteTalk. Remember, when you send a friend request to your friends, send them complete URL with your username, like www.sitetalk.com forward slash your username. Never send them only www.sitetalk.com because if they click on sign up on this page they will register with SiteTalk but computer will not know that they have joined SiteTalk through your reference that's why it's very important that you always send your username for them to join through on the left hand side corner you see a news corner and on top of it you see a link to download the desktop application. Now let's log in into SiteTalk account. You need to use your email as a username which you created when you logged in uh, when you sign up on SiteTalk. Then your password and then click on login. Once you log in on your page, on the right hand side, you can see we recommend. These are the recommended products and items from SiteTalk Mall. On top of it, you can see a search bar. You can write down the name of your friends you want to search or to become friend with, like If you type a name and they are already in your friend list, you see their name here. If they are not on your friend list, then you click on this search icon and it will show you the search results and you can become friends with other people. On the left hand side bar is your personal profile called My Profile. If you logged in for the very first time and you want to upload your picture or if you logged in later on and you want to change your picture you need to go to this corner and click on plus sign then you click on change profile picture and then from your laptop you can choose a folder where you have all the pictures you want to change with If you want to add or change your personal details, you click on this setting icon. And you can change your private profile, your likes, your dislikes, and other information. On the left hand side, under my profile, you see a link My Skills. You click on that one and then you can add information about yourself like your educational background and your work experience underneath that there is a link called my connections if you click on that one you'll be taken to the page where you can see all your friends on top of that you will receive friend requests from other people want to become friend with you. You have a choice to approve them, decline them or block them. Under my connections you see a link called my galleries. If you click on my galleries 
you have a choice to edit existing galleries or create new galleries. Once you create on new gallery, you can choose name click on create gallery and you can see this gallery has been created now if you want to upload pictures in the gallery you click on it and upload image and on this cloud icon where this arrow sign is you click and then from your computer choose the folder where you have all the pictures you want to upload in this gallery above your my profile there are four icons on the left hand side there is an icon called notifications click on that and you see notifications of events occurred in the last 24 hours the icon next to it is called my inbox you click on my inbox and you see all the messages which are private between you and your friends these messages are only seen by you and your friends and not on your wall the third icon from the left is called my chat once you click on that a new window will open where you can see your friends who are already online on site talk at this moment you can select them and you can talk to them the fourth icon on the right is called my wall if you click on that you see the messages between you and your friends which were written on your wall only but if you go and click the icon on the top side talk icon then my wall turns into my world this is where you see updates profile updates picture updates from all of your friends in your friend network once you complete using site talk you can log out at the bottom of the page but before that there is one more beautiful function in this site talk which is called translator you might have friends from different part of the world and they write down on site talk in their own language for example I have this friend called Mr. Ivan Krajcerik from Slovakia now he writes on his wall in of course Slovak language if I want to understand what he says then I go and click on this translator button and the Slovak is turned or translated into English now and I can read it and I can respond back if I like a post I can click on the full heart button and if I dislike I can click on the broken heart button and if I want to see how many people have liked my post then I can click on check and I can see all these people liked my post once you complete using or finish using site talk for now click on log out